I'm just about finished. What's cooking? Special bell peppers and beef. Asimov Solinson. He's our next target. Uh, listen, Jet. This guy's a major player in the Syndicate. Operates all around the asteroids. You said bell peppers and beef. His name's Asimov Solinson. Are you listening to me? There's no beef in here. So you wouldn't really call it bell peppers and beef, now would you? Yes, I would. Well, it's not! It is when you're broke, all right? What happened to the million Wulong reward we got for that last guy? The repair bill for that cruiser you wrecked. And the one from that shop you trashed. And the medical bill from the cop you injured. Kill the dough! No. Three days ago, there was a big shootout between his group and a rival syndicate. He killed his own guys, then took off like the wind. Word is he's hiding out with some sweet thing in Tijuana. TJ? That place is for small fries. Yeah, well, this small fries worth two and a half million. I don't feel like it. Speaking of beef, they say in TJ, the carnitas are out of this world. Attention. I hit up the cops for some clues. All right. Then I'll check in with old man Bull. You think you can trust that old codger? Nice 
this tune real easy. Because of what I done, I busted my tail to dig that gate. For criminy's sakes, you always say the same thing when you're losing. We all dug that gate together, and you know it. That we did. We worked like there was no tomorrow. And what do we got to show for it? Have a bloody Mary. In fact, me get a double. I've got the vodka, but I'm afraid I'm fresh out of tomato juice. I'm sure there's one can in the back room. I'll check. Premium Red Eye, you're a buyer, you know the score. Check it out. Is that real bloody eye? <laughs> I'm gonna need a little proof. Let's have a demonstration. This is real mystic and all, but, uh, do you have anything to eat here? Oh. I see. The red-eyed coyote will appear in the Zona Norte at the far end of town. That is what I see. A red-eyed coyote north of town? You, swimming bird. Huh? The swimming bird will meet a woman. The bird will be hunted by this woman. And then... Death. One more time. What's that? I was killed once before. By a woman. You take women too lightly, my friend. On the contrary. Catch you later. Wakantanka guide his spirit. President Day, eh? Think I'll have some on the house. Hmm? Huh? Uh. Damn! Just look at this. Asimov went berserk. No joke. We gotta take care of him before the cops move in. Maybe we should just let the cops deal with him. As long as he's using that red eye on himself, you can't beat him. 
We got to. If we don't get that bloody eye back, trust me, we'll all be twisting in the wind. Maybe so, huh? You. Uh? <gasps> Tell uh? me some more. I am starving. Hmm? So you're hungry too, huh, baby? You know, it's better to just leave the water running. So you don't clog the drain. I can see that. Just keep it. <laughs> Sorry. My stomach just took over my brain. It does that sometimes. Really? <laughs> <laughs> Nice shit? Yeah, it's a blast from the past. I've had it for ten years. It looks like it's been around. Guess you could say we've done some traveling. I'm actually a traveling performer. <laughs> I can tell when you're joking and when you're not. Yeah, I hear that a lot. Ever been to Mars? I was born on Mars. I hear they have everything there. Not like here. There's parks and festivals and the people are happy there. It must be a great place to live. Sure, if you're rich. Then I'm sure we will be quite happy. Planning to escape to Mars, huh? Huh? Go ahead and run. How far do you think you'll get? Who are you? I'm just an old-fashioned cowboy. You're a bounty hunter. Yeah, that's right. And you're after us. Your boyfriend is sick. He's a small fry. I don't bother with his type. A wise decision. Now who's the small fry? Asimov, that's enough. Let him go. Asimov, please, this has to stop. I think you liked him, didn't you? You left me there for so long, Asimov. I was just waiting for you to pick me up. Let's go, Asimov, like you promised. I want to get out of this life. I know that I can be happy on Mars. ourselves a little nap, huh? I had a sweet dream. That's heartwarming. And you can go right ahead and finish your dream back on the Peabop. I'm cashing in my chips on this one. It's impossible to catch the guy. There's no way to win it. When Asimov left his syndicate, he snuck some stuff out with him. Serious brew. This stuff's a total mind frag. 
It's a new kind of eye spray the syndicate cooked up. Very pure. Takes two months to make one vial. Our boy took off with every drop, which made him rather unpopular. They keep sending hit teams after him, but all they get back are corpses. Seems Azimov's been pumping up by doing this stuff himself. It's called Bloody Eye. No kidding. You know they're planning to go to Mars? Mars? But before that, they've got to sell these. Is that what I think it is? Yeah, I grabbed it out of his pocket. You met him? Yeah, so to speak. <laughs> he nailed you, huh? The red-eyed coyote will appear in the Zona Norte at the far end of town. you're talking about. Yes, yeah, sir, that we are. We planted those seeds like there was no tomorrow. You were always planting seeds of a different kind, though. Huh? So do you have any Bloody Marys? I only have beer. I got tomato juice. How much? 30 million wulongs for 50 packs. 15 million wulongs. I'm in a hurry. I've got other customers. Show me. <gasps> Looking for this? Do you know how much you're worth? What? 2.5 million wulongs. That's your bounty. I said you were a small fry. You look surprised. You look ridiculous in that outfit. I thought you weren't after my bounty. There's no thrill in the cheap ones, Asimov, you know? I think you do better as a thief, bounty boy. Now hand it over. Sure, I'd be glad to. I have to pay you back, don't I? <laughs> <laughs> Trust your eyes too much, Asimov. <laughs> You're not a chameleon, you know. You can't see everywhere at once. <laughs>
here now. I'll never see Mars. Adios. Hey, Spike, get it while it's hot, buddy. Huh? Peppers and bees. The show's finally underway. What's all this? Next week, we're totally changing gears. It's going to be anime for all ages. What's the story? House pets wreak havoc throughout the stars. What? <laughs> no, the guy who talks to animals will not make an appearance. But anyone who loves animals should gather around and watch this show. Hey, can we say stuff like that? I'm taking no responsibility for this. Caution. Small children should sit far back from the TV. Come on. How far back? About three quarters of a mile. That's too far. <laughs> okay, half a mile.